Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel Statisticians Hub. In this video, we will be learning how to create a word cloud in a speech based format using Python. So, in the previous video, we have learned how to make word cloud in a text based format. Okay, so this is the video. Click on the i tab and watch the video. So to perform speech based word cloud we have to import the necessary libraries and in this video we are imp importing a new library which is speech recognizer and I am using it as SR and these libraries are the common libraries that we have seen in the last video also so you have to import this one also now the file path so the first file path is the doc file path which is recognized speech dot docs okay this is the first file path that we have to use uh, for calling and saving uh, the text in the in this file path. Now the next file path is the mask image file path. So I am taking earth as my mask image. Right. Now let's define a function. So this function is uh, recognize the voice and save it in a docs file. So this is the main agenda of this function. So the first one is recognizer as I am taking as a variable and saving sr.recognizer function okay and with sr dot microphone i am taking microphone as my source and here i am printing say something it will print first it will print this uh, one in the output then uh, when a when a person say something it will recognize it uh, as as source is the microphone so it will recognize it and save it in a audio variable now it will uh, show that rec uh, recording complete now it will recognize it so we have to use the try and accept me uh, method in this uh, code so the first try so in the try section uh, text is equal to recognizer dot recognize google uh, and i am taking this uh, audio as the input so this will what what it will do it will go to the google and recognize the speech now here i am calling doc uh, which is equals to document and doc is equal to add paragraph uh, text doc is equal to save and doc file path this is the file path we have seen just now uh, then print text save this means if this output appeared then that that means the speech is recognized and it is saved in a doc file and now return text okay in the accept section sr dot unknown va uh, value error so this means if the machine does not understand the speech then it will throw this in the output section which is print could not understand audio and the next thing is request error request error means if it uh, it the code requests to google to recognize the speech and if it is unable to uh, unable to request to google then it will throw this in the output could not requ request results from google speech re re recognition service okay and then return none now i'm calling the function here uh, recognize uh, recognized text is equal to recognize voice and save to docs okay this is the function that we have defined just now and i'm uh, saving it in a variable recognized text now i'm using this uh, variable recognized text so if recognized text that means if it is available then mask image which is the numpy image and image dot open this is the mask file path that we have defined in just now and here the word cloud uh, which is equal to word cloud width i am setting width is 400 height is 200 you can set anything as you wish uh, then background color white max width 500 max font size 150 and random state is 400 then uh, 42 okay and then mask is equals to mask image okay uh, this thing you have to give if you want the word load in a uh, shape okay then dot generate recognized text now here i am importing the matplot library which is plt dot figure then plt dot im show the word load with uh, variable this this uh, word load variable i am calling it here then interpolation is equals to bilinear then uh, plt dot axis is off uh, this means the x and y axis will not show or will, will be uh, invisible in your output and plt.show so 
to perform this code i am using today visual studio so if you don't have the visual studio then go to this link i will give it in the description also then download the visual studio if you are a windows user then click on here if you are ubuntu user then click on here and if you are a mac user then click on here and then download it if you cannot download just comment it below i will make a video on that also now let's move to the visual studio so this is the png file art that i am using in this video uh, to make the word cloud now these are the imports that we have to uh, import this libraries and this is the file path now i am defining the function here recognize void voice and save to doc so this is the function now i'm calling the function and if uh, recognize text then mask image and these are the things that i've discussed just now now let's uh, run the code and say something so here you can see it is printing say something now if you say something then it will record it and recognize it okay just wait for a second so here you can see recording complete now recognizing text saved and this is the thing that i have just now said okay and here you can see the text file is also here just let me close it and here you can see a recognized speech dot doc file is uh, generated let me show you this one so here you can see the thing that i've said just now it is saved in the doc file and the respective word cloud is created now let's try again and say something else let's run the code again hello and welcome to statisticians hub i am thrilled you are here enjoying our videos and picking up some valuable insights whether you are a stats pro or just starting out there is something for everyone in our content so don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more exciting updates so you can see the recording complete now recognizing the text is saved the doc file is here now here you can see uh, the word cloud is created so this is how you perform word cloud on speech based so i hope you enjoyed the video if you have any doubt then comment it below and don't forget to like share and subscribe the channel thank you so much for watching